with a new champion coming in three days that blocks the goblin barrel reflects it what i've got a super mario Ultra lightning chest and a legendary chest that has a guaranteed champion but that's not enough we're 47 away from a royal wild chest that's one week away we gem open all of the chests until we get it oh that sucks oh my god he's got poison too Baby Dragon doesn't do diddly squat. We need... <laughs> Who uses Minion Horde in this day and age? Come on. There's our first chest. I should play ladder so I can get the boost. Everything feels so slow now. 18 gems. That's chest number two. Oh, I lost the tower because I missed a tornado. I'm dumb. Baby Dragon connected. It's good. 18 gems. This would be 9 gems once I reach 5,300 trophies. That's chest number 3. Oh, yeah. I knew that activation was going to be really beneficial for the Skeleton King. That's so nice. We just wrecked a Penta Piglet push. All right, I got a unique game for y'all. It's filled with crime, conspiracies, cool characters, puzzles, and mutated monsters. That's right. Path to Nowhere is today's video sponsor that mixes real-time strategy with an intense crime drama featuring the mysterious SCP organization. Take on the role as chief of the MBCC and use your investigative abilities to uncover the truth behind a dangerous plague outbreak. Path to Nowhere launched in China in August and quickly became the top free-to-play game. And it's even won an Editor's Choice Award. People, People of, of culture, culture who enjoy, who enjoy anime. anime. We'll enjoy the wide cast of characters with the unique designs. Plus, you can collect skins to customize how they look. The voice acting is great, and it really adds to the crime thriller vibe. Through the gacha, you'll get to arrest the city's most wanted sinners by unlocking their mugshots. Tactically deploy these sinners in battle to clear monsters, but instead of the regular cost limit you see in other games, you can actually move the characters during battle. So you'll see a lot of tactical decisions to make as the monsters move along their path. Use ultimate abilities to break through the monster's core to stun elite monsters before they do an all-out attack. This breakthrough mechanic will be super important when facing harder monsters. Some of my favorite parts of this game are the maze and interrogation modes. You can interrogate the sinners by asking them the right questions, paying attention to their facial expressions. So you got mystery, crime, waifus, and strategic-driven gameplay. What more could you want? Check out Path to Nowhere by using the QR code or the links below. Also, use my exclusive onboarding code now to unlock your new identity. I don't think Zappies can counter Graveyard that well. They lost that side and they lost the Zappies. There's no point putting Zappies down. Imagine my Skeleton King getting his ability again. It's costing me a lot of gems. That's beautiful. We're 42 chests away. We need to farm to tier 30 so we can get this tier unlocked so we can milk it. We need to hit 5,300 so that our chests will half in time so that the gems will cost half as much. Stupid Barbarians, that's not gonna accomplish nothing. He will have minions though, so we gotta poison that. Oh! King active. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Tornado should finish that off. We're good. Call me crazy. But we're going to activate the King Tower now. I'm that confident. <laughs> Why is it working? <laughs> I didn't even tank the left side. How did we win that? Welcome to being stupid with OJ and actually winning in low ladder. Okay, 5,300. Let's go. You're done, son. There's an ice wizard tanking. For every arrow that the ice wizard tanks, that's one extra skeleton that dies. How do you know when you're getting the Royal Well chest? Um, if you go on Deck Shop Pro or Royal API and then you enter in your account, you can see your chest cycle and the Royal Well chest is right there. We're actually 40 away now. Well, might as well use the ability, because, uh, that ain't going nowhere anytime soon. I'm using one of the most toxic decks you've ever seen. Graveyard is toxic? Where's that boost? We're, we're just one game away from the boost. That's so satisfying. Bowling under level players. Okay, now we can play Lumber Rush. And I have the perfect deck for that. That Lumberjack is actually wrecking me so hard right now. Should I E-Golem? E-Golem might be the play. I want the fastest three crown deck. We're just going to blast through everything. Woo! Let's go! Funny how that clone did diddly squat, but my Lumberjacks connecting on the right side are wrecking him. No 
Okay, that's it. 37 chests away. So this was 18 gold. This should be nine gold now. Yeah, we're good. All right, here we go. This is not three crown worthy. We need to three crown the frick out of them. And not like two and a half minutes. We need like fast. All right, spicy toast. What's the, what's the play for uh, your 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 deck? Do I just go in elixir golem right off the bat, or do I wait for double elixir? Because I want a three crown fast. Okay, we're just gonna go in. That that did not work that well. That did not work that well. That did not work that well. This ain't a three crown deck, spicy toast. Or we just three crown like that. That could work. I'll keep giving this deck a chance. Maybe I just need to learn it. Which spawns units faster in Rage Arena? 35% more. And it's more anti-air. I did not need to do an Elixir Goal in there. Because now I have nothing for the Sparky. My god. Is this how we farm the three crowns? We're 34 chests away. This is a tough one. He's actually fighting back. I don't like it. Well, here we go. I don't know what's going on in that blob of stuff, but I'm gonna use that elixir golem to tank for my lumberjacks. Oh boy, I don't think we're gonna win this. Just saying. I got nothing on that right side. Fine. Elixir golem into the other lane. Let's go. Which, which was a good swap for cannon cart for this specific mode? Spiffy toast. I love your deck. We're 32 chests away. This is actually going faster than I was anticipating. Let's go. Lumberjack's gonna pop. It's gonna give me that massive rage. That's it. You can't, you can't stop this. We're chilling. It's double elixir. It's Morbin time. We're gonna take advantage of that rage spell and everything else going on. I have no idea what it is exactly. I don't know what's going on, on the left side. I'm just going to arrows. There's so much going on. All right. We lost the left side. That's fine. <laughs> I arrows to nothing. And I just tombstoned on top of the Valkyrie. You know what? I feel like I threw. Free spell. Spiffy tunes. You're onto something. All right, well, arrows is one, one, one. So, mirror arrows, 162. It's the sixth card that's kind of wonky, and we'll do Sparky. I think Sparky's really good. <laughs> All right. He just cloned that? <laughs> no, this is it. This is it. I think this is the deck. This is the deck. What the? They just gave me arrows value. That's insane. And the witch spawns way more skeletons. Offensive tombstone! Let's go! Nope. Offensive tombstone won it for me. I just dodged the log because I'm amazing. How do you stop the left side? You don't. Because I've got elixir golems on elixir golems on elixir golems on elixir golems! Just for good luck, we're gonna snowball that. And then we're good. And we're back to Elixir Golem, Mirror Elixir Golem. And Lumberjack Connection on the right. Here we go. The big sweet mother load of pushes. Let that world champion connect. And then we're just gonna aggressively. We're just gonna aggressive. Alright, getting aggressive did not work. <laughs> Sparky saves the day. Let's go. We almost lost this. Jeez. Okie dokie. We just need to stop those lumberjacks. Three crown. Lumberjack connected. Lumberjack connected. Well, here we go. Double elixir golems. With the golden knight to mostly take care of it all. We're blasting through this. 20 more. 22 more. There's a Hail Mary on the right side now. I don't exactly know what's going on, but I don't care to know what's going on. Oh, yeah. I took out the wizard and everything. And the goblin, the blobs are still alive. Let's go. 
We've got to defend the right side, and if we can get that goblin blob going on, we're good. <laughs> oh my god, it took out his lumberjack! He dark goblin into the lumberjack! These one minute games, they're too easy! Is this deck good for battles too? Absolutely not. It's only specifically good for this mode because it specifically counters the Lumberjacks and it specifically is good for the Raid Arena. Not gonna lie, this ain't good. He's got like 10 Lumberjacks. You... We're not defending that push. It's our first loss in a while, I'm fine. How do you defend all of that? Am I in danger? Lumberjacks connect, let's go! Woo! I don't know what's going on on the top side. I just know that we're winning. There's the giant chest. That means we're 17 away from prediction something. No prediction. 3M, it's not enough. It really isn't enough. That lumberjack's gonna pop and it's gonna be a rage. It's over. It's actually over for me because I just fed him like 10 million elixir. Oh no. Uh, you know what? It's offensive tombstone time. How does he not have 10 million elixir from all, of, all the stuff I just fed him? We should not have won that. How many is that? 15 away? My god. It's done for you. It's over. Two lumberjacks. It's gonna pop for the rage for the elixir golems. Mighty magic archer. That's not enough. If this is a full spawner deck, it's gonna beat me. I'm not even gonna defend it because this will just... Spawners have a really high win rate, like 80% in rage mode, but it takes like four or five minutes to finish. There we go. Always play witch. She's so good in here. She's a mobile spawner, 35% more. All right. <clears throat> Let's get it. It's an overflowing chest. I don't want that. That's 36 gems I have to waste. Uh, I don't know how I feel about those lumberjacks in my towers. We're going to do that. And then the Sparky wins! Let's go! I'm gonna ignore that barrel completely. It doesn't even matter. So we're gonna lumberjack the heck out of the, the left side in the King Tower. Sparky's on there. That's good. Golden chest! We're 10 away. That balloon going to town on me? That's that's nothing. That's the cost of business. Two Lumby boys on the tower. Woo! Come on! We literally can't lose this right now. We literally just lost this right now. Ah, frick, missed the snowball. That's not good. At least the lumberjack on the right side is going to town. Gobbling up that tower. Just defend this, and then we're good. We're not good. That dark goblin's obnoxious. I didn't even see them on my tower. Dang. Bro, we're only 10 away. Stop stream sniping me. You're hard countering me. This is the only combination of cards kind of going to cause me trouble. Oh, goodness gracious. That's goblin giant. That's it. I can't defend that. Take my king tower. All right. Our objective right now. I have no idea what our objective is. To win. The tombstone. Good. Hurry up. That'd be great. I think I have enough to arrows. Mirror arrows. Woo! We did it. Wait, what? Double elixir golem into lumberjacks worked? <laughs> Lumberjack onto firecracker. They lost their tower. Sparky's at full health. Lumberjack's there. I don't even know what he put down, but the Golden Knight countered it completely. No mercy. Woo! They can't defend a quadruple Elixir Golem push, right? I don't even know where my Golden Knight is. Okay, they defended a, a quadruple go Elixir Golem push. Are people starting to counter me? That was a straight up hard counter. All right, we've re regained, regained foothold in our footing. Oh my god! 94 health! The lumber That snowball barely made me win the game! We have to BM that. Woo! I don't know what's there. I just know that we've won. We've won. We'll do a witch there. Maybe we'll do a little arrows there. Three chests away. Let's get it. The grand finale.
I don't know what's going on. I just know stuff's going on, and we're going to win. Mirror Elixir Golem. You don't stop that. Bruh, I'm getting countered. Chat, you're stream sniping me. You're stream sniping me. What was the point of even kiting that? All I did was feed him. We're literally two away. E Barnes be gone. I'm struggling. You get it, OJ. You get it. They can't stop the Sparky. That's greatness. Elixir Golem. Sparky. Ugh. We're one away. E Barnes, forget you. We're in mid ladder territory and it's obnoxious. One more game. It's Sparky, I'm joking. That's what I thought. That's what I think about your Sparky. Oh my God. Let me just kite that into the other lane. Holy, I'm actually so good. I'm so good. There's no point in even playing against me. You auto lose, but if you, if you match with me, it's an auto lose. The Royal Wild Chest. There's no way we're not gonna max the new champion and legendary card now. We have three Royal Champion Chests. Two on my slot, one in the pass. I've got three legendary books. I've got two book of books, one in here and one in the pass. Oh, I am so ready for this.